the conversation and the debate about zoning in Nigeria, especially with regards to the presidency come 2023, has been on. Why a lot of people think that regardless of which zone, once someone is qualified, he or she should be given the position or given the opportunity to lead the country. Some others think that because some other zones have had the privilege of leading, other zones also should be given the privilege to lead. We're on the streets of Abuja to find out opinions of Nigerians about zoning and the zoning system in Nigeria. Okay, actually, the zoning is actually right. As a matter of fact, it's because of them. Um, and our politicians are not sincere. Zoning ought not to work. We're supposed to go for the best brain and um, the most suitable for the job. But you know one thing about Nigeria? It's, um, the stronger you are, the winner takes it all. Um, that's why we started having the issue of zoning. But of course, as a matter of fact, you can see that the zoning has not really worked. Because if they want to do the zoning in the real sense, it should be done within the six geographical zone. But now we're doing within, between now north and south. And from what we are hearing recently, somebody's coming up to say that the uh, zoning does not really make any sense, that um, it should be excellence, which I agree with him. The way we see the north going, they don't want to let go. So that's why they are trying to see the issue of zoning should not work. You know, not they believe that um, power belongs to the north. But um, I, I, this time around, is not going to work for them. So if we agree on zoning, though it's not in the constitution, uh, if we agree on a mutual agreement that zoning should work, I think they should allow it to go. Agree? I believe so much in zoning, and I will appreciate if that will be zoning, because that's the only thing that will bring unity among Nigerians, so that all of us will have sense of belonging. So if one section of this country rules, then the other one rules. So that is the only way. And that is the only thing that can unite this country so that no section will face cheated. That is just my belief. Well, I really believe in the zoning system, but I don't think the, the cabals are following what should be done. Because if they are to follow what should be done, I believe it's time for the East to rule Nigeria. Because since the coup in those days, I think no Igbo man has been the president. Apart from Jonathan that is partly related to the Igbos, I think it's unfair and it's ungodly. Because if they should believe that Nigeria is one, then they are supposed to give the Igbos the opportunity to rule. That is my belief. Well, uh, in the zoning system, uh, PDP started it uh, during uh, uh, Kweme, when he's the board of the trustee. So, and that zoning formula is in BDP, and uh, APC later adopted it. So the zoning formula is good, because uh, what you do to uh, uh, James, make it do it to John. So now, if they will be rotating it, I think uh, the election will not be more uh, expensive. Uh -huh. So they will not, uh, 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 any election will be high in, in spending money. But because of the nature of Nigeria, so that zone is okay, and each zone you will have to, you are supposed to get a capable person in each zone. Uh, but each zone is is, is, um, is millions uh, of people. The zone that deserves it is uh, the southeast, uh, which uh, everybody knows. Uh, no need of arguing. Uh, they know that southeast never tested it since democracy. So they should give it uh, them a free hand, let them try it, and learn again and see what they can do. Uh -huh. you know, they are, now, you know, South East, they have uh, their economies and their they um, business inclined. So if you give them this, uh, this uh, then Nigeria will see the difference. Although all I know is that Nigeria is fearing because if uh, South East uh, take there, then there, there will be a good change. And uh, maybe others want that to rule, the shame may catch them. That's why they are frustrating them. Because I know that if South East is there, there will be a difference. The economy will grow. Everything will go in order. I, um, I see it as a very good idea because it will help. Everybody bring out their ideas, at least every Zoom we have their say in the country. To not be as if it's a, it's a northern thing, it's a southern something. It will be as if it's something that every Zoom will have a say, at least. It will not be as if it's one Zoom that is ruling. So at least it's a very good idea and I will buy the idea. It's a very good one. Please. It's the best thing, like what, what Southwest is doing now. They want to, be, they want to bring a community police, I've forgotten the name of the Yoruba or something. It's the best thing. Let's start, start have their, their own. North East have their own, South West have their own. It's the best thing. The presidency can be for the South South. I don't want to mention them. Well, I really don't like getting involved in uh, discussing politics.
because uh, one thing is that it seems that like a lot of discussions go on, people give their opinions, but it never really seems to get home to the right ears. If, if you ask me, politically, yes, we have made some little progress, but the Nigerian system requires an overhaul. What I mean is, you know, a system that does not have ideological coordination, where there can be follow-ups even if presidents leave and other presidents come in. To me, zoning is not really such a big deal. I, I think Nigerian politics are, is developing to a point where maybe uh, persons, but the problem is the right persons <laughs> find it very difficult to be able to get to the, you know, the seat of power for too many obvious reasons. So ideological change is one very paramount thing. I, I'm not one of those who believe in blaming leadership alone. Every uh, leadership is made of the followers. So the Nigerian society needs a total rethink and reorientation. It is so unfortunate. You see, when you look at the salient issues and the challenges Nigerians are facing, now we don't have we are not supposed to be where we are now. Nigerians cannot be the mo among the most hungry people in the world when Nigeria, you know, parades the best of human resources and even natural resources. So it's, the key issue is not about which zone the president is coming from. It's about an ideological direction. Thank you. Thank you. We've heard the opinions of Nigerians about the zoning system in Nigeria. Why some think that regardless of which zone one comes from, anyone who qualifies to, for the position should be given. Others think that because one zone has gotten, another zone should also be given the opportunity to lead. Now, what do you think? You can go to our comment section and share your opinions. Quest Ahundu, reporting for TVN News.